friends, welcome to Baby Garden, where we grow our readers one rhyme at a time. It's a beautiful day, and we're going to have our own sunshine in here. I'm so excited because Baby Garden is like one of my favorite programs I like to do. I get to start the week off with something fun like this, so I am so super excited. So to get us all started, we want to sing our choo-choo-choo-choo song. If you look at your little paper song book, it is the first song on your sheet. We want to move our baby's arms or our baby's legs. And if you're at home watching and you have some safe space, you can move all around. And you can. You are watching. Thank you. Can you think you can move your arms like this? Okay, and if you want to, you can move your baby's legs. And when I point to you, I want you to say your name because we're going to make like a train that's going to go all the way around until it comes back to me, okay? So let's go. Choo, 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 up the railroad track. Choo, 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 then we come right back. First we'll go to Audrey's house and then we'll go to Charlie's house and then we'll go to Mia's house and then we'll go to Roman's house and then we'll go to Carter's house and then we'll come right back. Choo 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 up the railroad track. Choo 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 choo. Then we come right back. And don't forget if you're at home watching and you are in a daycare environment, make sure you include all your children's names so you can make your train as long or as short as it need to be, okay? Yeah. But right here, we had a nice little train going on. You see right here? So the first book that we're going to read is a favorite book. <gasps> the Very Hungry Caterpillar. And you know what? This is one of the books where I think everyone should have a copy of this book at home. It comes in so many different formats and sizes, so you can get one that best suits your family, okay? I like this little size for this group because this is just perfect for us. Yes, that's Clifford the yeah. Big Red Dog. Clifford yeah. the Big Red Dog. And you know what? Clifford's going to sit there. Does he have his listening ears on? Yeah. Okay, good job. We need that. His listening ears on. Okay, so we're going to get started. The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Barry Cole. Lots of pretty colors there. There we are. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. <gasps> Can you pinch that little egg? No. Just... And look at the moon. It has two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Wow, let's turn the page. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and a very hungry caterpillar. There he is, the little caterpillar. Let's turn our page. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. Mmm, that's delicious. Let's turn our little page. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears. Can you yeah. count them? One, two. two. But he was still hungry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's turn our page. Mm -hmm. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums. But he was still hungry. Can you count the plums with me? One, we count two, three. Good job. Let's turn our page. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries. But well, he was still hungry. Mmm, mmm, those strawberries. Let's count and make sure it was really four. One, two, 
Let's turn our page. On Friday, he ate through five oranges. Mm, mm, mm. But he was still hungry. <laughs> we have to get all the way to five. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. Let's turn our page. Oh, look at this good stuff. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake. Mm, one ice cream cone, yummy. One pickle. One slice of Swiss cheese. One slice of salami. One lollipop. Mm. One piece of cherry pie. One sausage. One cupcake. And one slice of watermelon. That night he had a stomach ache. Oh my goodness. So he ate so much. Can you turn your page? Okay. There you are. Thank you. You're welcome. Let me catch up with everyone else. Oh, my little page won't turn. Let's get this page. Oh, there it is. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf. Mm -hmm. And after that, he felt much better. Wow, let's turn that page. Now he wasn't hungry anymore, and he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out, and let's see, he was a beautiful butterfly. Oh, that is perfect. The end. Yay! Our next song that we're going to sing is called, Oh My Goodness, Down by the Station. We know that one because we like that puff, puff. That's pretty cool. We like that. So, let's get started. You ready to sing with me? Okay, let's go. Down by the station, early in the morning, see the little puffer bellies all in a row. See the station master pulling on the lever. Puff, puff, woo, woo, off we go. You want to sing that one more time? Maybe we can sing it a little faster because we like to speed things up around here. Add a little spice to it. So let's get started. Ready? Let's go. Down by the station early in the morning. See the little puffer bellies all in a row. See the station master pulling on the lever. Puff, puff, woo, woo, off we go. Good job. That was super fun. That was so much fun. Yes, Carter really like that. We can move them so fast with that. Good morning. Would you like to put a chair to join in? I'm just going to hang out back here. Join now, because we have some songs Thank for you, you to sing. I'll sing. <laughs> Our next book is called I Am a Big Sister. Whoa, I Am a Big Sister. And this book is written by Caroline. Caroline. Jane Church. We like this book because she writes a series of books that we really, really enjoy. I am a big sister. Um, Shelly, can you do me a favor? Can you hand me another? Is it another set of books up there? I think we may. Okay, well, we'll, we'll steal yours. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. And we'll let you sit there and you can share a book. Good, thank you. So let's turn to where our story starts. Sure you can. Look at you. Our new baby arrived today. I'm a big sister now. Hooray. Wow, let's turn our page. Here we are. I used to be a little baby too. But now I'm big. Look what I can do. 
Oh my goodness, I like that. This is a rhyming story. Let's turn our page. I can help when baby feeds and always find what baby needs. It's good to have an extra set of arms around, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Let's turn the page. Dirty diaper, yuck. Let's see. Here's a clean one found by me. Mm, the stinky paper. <laughs> Let's turn our page. Mommy and Daddy says I'm clever and that I'm the best sister ever. Let's turn our page. When we cuddle, the baby wriggles. Give a tickle, baby giggles. Oh, oh my goodness, I like to do that. Let's turn our page. Splish, splash, bath. It's lots of fun. Bubble washing, and then we're done. Let's turn our page. Yes. When babies sleep, shh, no noise. Definitely not. I quiet, I quietly play with all my toys. Yeah, we don't want to break those babies up. <laughs> Turn our babies. But if baby wakes with cranky cries, I softly say sweet lullaby. That's a good thing. Turn your page. And as baby grows, we'll play together because I'm a big sister forever. No. Thank you. Turn your page. Mommy, Daddy, Baby, Me. We love each other. We family. The end. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we love sing another song. This is the way we go to the zoo. Oh, this is so much fun because we like to sing this one. So, we're going to the zoo like this. And if you have your little wand, you can just tap your baby's legs. <laughs> We're just going to walk to the zoo right now. Okay, so ready? This is the way we go to the zoo. Go to the zoo, go to the zoo. This is the way we go to the zoo so early in the morning. Uh-oh, guess what? <gasps> Those boys made us late. This morning, <laughs> they probably couldn't find their shoes. We're going to have to go a little faster. You ready? Let's go. This is the way we go to the zoo. Go to the zoo. Go to the zoo. This is the way we go to the zoo. So early in the morning. Those girls made us late this morning. They didn't want to get bowls in their hair. We're going to have to go as fast as we can go. Let's go. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh my goodness, I just love singing that song. That is so much fun. Let's see what our helpful hint is today. We try to give a helpful hint every week. Remember, my favorite helpful hint is to sing rhymes with your baby. I'll probably tell you that over and over again. If your baby knows eight rhymes by the age of four, they'll be a better reader by the age of eight, okay? So make up silly rhymes. Check out some books about nursery rhymes. Make sure you know them also. And just rhyme, 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 because that will help them with their reading skills, okay? But to also help them, it says give the baby a hand. So while our babies are little, like that little one, and as soon as they're able to grasp things, Put down like little Cheerios or something they can pick up. Let them hone in those fine motor skills because that also is going to help them turn pages. They'll be able to pick up those little pages and turn them over. So you can use crackers, of course goldfish crackers, everybody loves them. Um, maybe some peas, mm, I don't know about the peas, but maybe if your baby really loves peas, then you can use peas. Anything that's really, really small to help them pick up and grasp, and that will help them with their, um, that will help those hands grow nice and strong and agile, okay? So that's super, super cool. Let's see if we have another song to sing, because we love singing songs. Oh, I'm a little teapot. This is a favorite. 
Oh, we all know this one because this was what was saying to some of us when we were little. Oh, so we have to put a handle here. And we have to put a stop here. And we're going to sing I'm a little teapot. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is a handle, here is a stout. When a girl sings up, hear me shout. Tip me over and pour me out. Oh, let's do that again. Yay. We were so good. Yay. Let's do that one more time. You ready? Okay. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all seamed up, hear me shout. Tip me over and pour me out. going to do next we're going to clear some space here and we're going to get some scarves out and we're going to move around to our favorite song by our favorite artist which is Jeff Sork and you know what Jeff Sork comes to this area sometimes maybe we can get him to come one day to baby guard he can perform this song for us Ten hit Jeff Sork if you're watching us see if we can follow the directions of the song. We're going to touch our nose and touch our toes and clap for the mark. But just so we can let us know what to do, okay? Uh, would you let me find. You gotta touch your toes. Play with some bubbles and some other little toys that we have, okay? 
so we'll do dressing. So this is our baby shark sauce. <laughs> oh my. I know you adults are so excited. <laughs> We've been singing this song because it was part of this program that we brought and it's, we've been doing that for like 16 years. So even though you've just been singing it probably for the last three, I've been singing Baby Show for about 16 years. And so we're singing, I know most people don't know it, but it's Girl Scouts too. Yeah, it was. Really? Yeah. I didn't know my mother was like, actually you guys used to have to go <laughs> and she loves it. So we sing yeah. it the old way, the original way. Okay. You know, it's been jazzed up, wrapped, and everything else. But we know we're still singing the original way. This is Baby Shark. This is Brother Shark. Mama. Then we're going to swim. And then we're going to swim a little faster. And it's a gotcha at the end. We'll let you decide how big the gotcha is going to be for you. Okay? Let's go. Baby Shark. Do, do. Do, 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 do. Gotcha. Oh, gotcha. oh my goodness, we were swimming so fast and shark didn't get anyone here because we was really, really so so cool. Oh, we had a fun time. Yeah. Yeah. I hope you had a fun time yeah. at home. And make sure you do some more reading to your babies throughout the day. And we'll see you the next time. Bye-bye.